Howdy who and welcome to Nev's Gaming. It is another episode and today we are finishing off the accommodation area with a couple more bills happening. So let's bob over there and take a absolute fantastical look. I've got a load of snowballs because I'm building in the snowball area. There we go, I come fly then. Uh, if we remember, we can see these two beautiful bills that we did last time. Absolutely love them, especially when you're looking at them from afar as well. They're just so picturesque. And then we've got this build here. This is going to be the first squeezed-in build right next to our black on that. I've used a different colour so you can differentiate between. So we've sort of gone from light to dark to light. And then I'm going to introduce another light build, but we're going to have this dark accent here so we can differentiate. And the buildings don't blend in too much. You'll have that clear separation. Now, originally on this, I was using... Um, and the site, smooth on the site, and uh, just normal on the site on the front, but it just did not look right. Um, it, it absolutely looked horrible to be honest. So I've changed it up. I've kept the under site wall just again to keep that, that differentiated, but instead I've gone for white concrete, like I'm going to be using over in that build. And I think there's just a more smooth follow as we go from a more Victorian build to more modern as we go further down here and closer to the Christmas Village. Absolutely fantastic. Well, I'm going to crack on with my first build, which is the modern slash Victorian slash renovated build. And I'll come back with an update. Voila! Two buildings, outer trims, complete. Uh, as I was saying earlier, we're going to go from like a more Victorian, more older style build, work our way along to a more modern build. Uh, what I've done here is I've incorporated the stone, the black stone, and even, um, what's this called? What is this called? Ah, I cannot remember what this is called. Uh, not andesite. No, oh, what's it called? Off the top of my head, I cannot remember. Diorite, there we go. Here's the day. But yeah, we've incorporated the smooth diorite there, even the diorite on the actual overhang builds. Like, we used copper and sandstone there. We've gone for diorite here. This um, blackstone is meant to, again, mimic gutter room for the water to run off and down it. It's almost like a spout, um, so it doesn't stay on the flat ceiling. Uh, we've stuck with the, again, the overturned stairs. But this moves into a more modern build where the white concrete actually happens. And appears, which is fabulous. Uh, in, as inside's not done yet, but we've gone for a black tile. So listen to that as you're walking upstairs. Ah, oh, I like that. It's like a clinking sound, which I really love. Uh, but if we go across this little backdoor pathway, because this is going to be the rear entrance out of the uh, out of Nevtopia. If we go over here, you can see this is a more modern build. Now, I've introduced a couple of trapdoors there just to break up the colour a little bit because it is a very, very dark black and I'm going to have to use dark door, uh, dark door here. So, uh, first things first then, let's go and get the windows in and then the doors and proceed from there. I'm invisible again. I really need to take that dinosaur head off, but it just looks so awesome. Rawr. It's snowing. As I uh, finish the windows and doors, as you see, I've got glass in my hand. But if we take another look at the build there, you see I've gone for green glass there. And I think it does, it's a nice break. So what I've tried to do is I've tried to make it not similar to these colours as we go along the building here. So we've got the yellow, we've got the blue, we've got the lime green, and then we've got the red. So they are really different builds altogether. And to break up the black here, I've generally used a lot of mangrove. But I've used the mangrove gates over here and I think that does accompany it well right all we've got left to do now on these builds is uh, to put some greenery in and then that's the second lot of accommodation done oh this area is coming on well I also want to start moving to the basalt light region so we'll start on that after we've completed it well the shrubbery anyway shrubbery with a dash of colour here and there, there is the shrubbery piece done. Now I've gone for a little bit of bushes in the corners here, so it doesn't involve the main walkway. I may put a table out here, table and deck chair, you know, just sitting out, having a you know, nice coffee while, every, while the world passes by. Uh, but here I've gone for the sort of the same, the same design, drooping, drooping leaves, just to break it break it up. 
Uh, and I've added a mixture. I've used these Ailey leaves because they're not going to go uh, white in the snow. Uh, same, same over here in the more modern era build. We've used the green leaves again. And the uh, green leaves, azalea leaves again with the azalea flowering bushes. And it just breaks it up a little bit more. Right, my final thing to do, because I've got a bit of time, is I want to build a basalt generator. Oh, yeah, basalt generator. So we need a few things. Smooth um, soul sand. And we need some blue ice. And lava, is this making you go dizzy? Right, let's get this thing built over in our industrial district. Basalt generator complete. And as you can see here by uh, my lovely assistant, Miss Pixie, she is kindly mining basalt. I don't know whether this is for herself or for me. I can't really tell because she hasn't said anything yet. But as you can see, simple design. Bish, bash, bosh. Let's have a quick little look. Simple redstone all the way around triggers the uh, the uh, observer sensors, the piston push that then triggers at the redstone, which then loops around all that good stuff. Powers that, which powers the piston. Jobs are good in. Remember, you need blue ice, a bit of lava, and some um, soul soil, and then you just mine it and just gets collected by the hoppers and into this chest down here. Job is a good in. Right. I'm going to end the episode there. I've been Nevs Gaming. All you beautiful people have been amazing. Toodaloo. Like and subscribe. And I'll see you in a few. Good.